Hi, welcome to the Lion Centero. Today is Tuesday, October 15th, and I am going to go ahead and, since I'm on a roll, do the future of size um, company. So let's kind of see what Archangel Gabriel has to say about the overall energy of size company or um, overall message or overall outcome. Let's see if there's anything that I, I can make sense of that comes out for that. And you know what? I forgot my intro. Welcome to the Lion's Den. And today, Psy, as Psy's company, whatever the name is, because I forgot it already, they can step on in. They can step into the den. So... Mother Mary actually flipped over before um, when I was shuffling um, because I was shuffling before and I'd forgotten to push the cord, shoved it back in. Um, Mother Mary is back out. I keep leaning these cards on everything and they don't even like really stand. Um, share your art with the world. Okay. It's time to allow others to enjoy your creative um, work. And then we have creative expression. It says God's, God's divine creativity is expressed through your actions. Okay. So with these, I'm definitely seeing that they're going to be dropping a few music videos. Um, they will be releasing art into the world. Um, that's basically a no-brainer. But let's get into seeing exactly um, how the world will, will receive it. So immediately this card is standing out to me. I'll just pull these two. How the world will receive... Um, how the world will receive size company and artists. Interestingly enough, um, the first card is the initial the initial card is happiness, joy. We have the three of cups. But I'm seeing things kind of very, very quickly going downhill. I don't know what happens because then we have the devil. So we have the devil card that comes out. We have the fool in reverse. So we have the fool. Like almost even not going anywhere. It could be like silly mistakes or decisions. We have fighting. The five of wands. Um, to reverse, it's still the same thing, just on smaller scales. So it could be infighting. And we also have the five of swords. Okay, so that could also be betrayal. So, or misuse of, of power. So, it's very interesting. It's like the initial reaction to them dropping some more music this year, or any music at all, because I don't know who's under Psy Nation. I know maybe Edwin or something, but I don't know if any music has dropped so far yet. The initial response is happiness, and then it kind of goes into a lot of negative things that are kind of coming out in the end. Um, possibly the case of... Possibly the case of just like any other company, um, which is a shame because you know you have the you have Mother Mary here. So Mother Mary is supposed to be when this card is coming out, especially in a reading like this, to me is saying making a safe space for other artists. But it's I guess it won't be that safe in the end after all. So let me just I want to use this deck to go into more detail about what may be going. And this is the Gay Tarot. I want to go um, more into detail about what is going on in size company um, and what what is the reason why it will be going it may go downhill. So one more time I'll shuffle and see what I get. 
Okay, we have jumping cards. So I'm just going to go ahead and take some jumping cards if there are any more. Okay. We have a lot of aces. Okay, we have two of wands. Okay, so I'm going to read these all upright anyway. Okay, so how I feel about this right now is it, the company itself, they're going to be pretty straight, but it seems like there's going to be some money issues and also issues with levels of creativity. Um, it does seem like there's, you know, they're going to connect with people. Their company is going to be able to connect with people through their artists, um, connect to their artists. But there is still a bit of indecision that's there with this Two of Wands. Um, so there's still a bit of indecision. There's still a bit of confusion on what path to go down, what path to take. Um, there's a lack of money. That may be um, money distribution problems that may come and cause some infighting. Um, you know, there may be a little bit of creative blocks. So there may, this is probably why there will be some people that may have issues with each other. But it does seem like overall the company will last because it, it seems like it's meant to. Overall, you know, everybody should be happy. Because we end with the Ten of Cups. So, it's starting off pretty good and then going downhill. That part of going downhill may be one of the first bigger hurdles that they have before they get everything back on track. So, they're going to have to deal and um, really work with uh, their, their levels of creativity, um, freedom of creativity. They're also going to have to work with budgeting. Um, so... Those are the two things that they're going to have to work with in order to keep everybody satisfied and everybody happy within the company. Um, if they fail at that, you know, it could end up making everything go downhill, maybe losing artists, things like that. But if Sai can keep that and manage that properly, everybody should be able to be fine and they should be able to um, earn money rather than losing most of it. Okay? Um, so last, I guess I will check on Sai's mental state and just see how Sai is feeling about the company. Um, we have Eight of Wands and Five of Cups. There is some disappointment here. We have the Fool. Um, there, there's some disappointment here. Like I feel like he feels like, yeah, he feels like he's made some mistakes. Um, the money, the budgeting. Again, we have this this new business or this create this this level of creativity that's here. Um, oh my God! Okay, wow. So I don't think things have gone even with the nine of coins. It's like he has the he still has the money now. Um, we have three of swords in reverse, so it's heartbreak. Sai has not made the best decisions, and that's how I feel like it's going right now. Sai has not made the best decisions with his money. Um, I feel like he may have made a mistake that he realizes that he's made now and has some regrets about it. Um, he's concerned about his business and launching his business. I don't know if it has started yet, but I keep getting Ace of Wands, so I feel like, you know, even though it's been active, it hasn't necessarily launched yet. I don't know why. But, um... Yeah, he's he's very concerned of being able to hold up to the standards that he wants to hold hold the company up to. Um, there's a little bit of uh, or a very strong sense of sorrow or heartbreak break. So there's something that he may have had to let go, something that he had had to abandon, something that did not come through. Maybe an artist he was just not able to pull, and this changes the perspective on on everything and how he's going to manage his company. So basically, Sai is going through a lot of um, troubles with wondering how he's going to manage when these certain things that he seems to have been banking on are not.
pulling through for him. Um, and it turns out that he may be having to spend a lot money or more money or put out a lot more money than he was expecting to have to put out. So that's kind of what's going on with Psy. Um, but like we, like I said, it seems like in the long run, the company will still be prosperous. Just, you know, another company. Um, they should be okay. Uh, and that's all I have for you guys. So let me know if you have any other questions. Leave them in the comment section below. I'll probably answer them on Twitter if you need. Um, and until next time, guys. Bye.